Hey everyone, I'm Uzair from ways2sellonline.com and I'm here to help you in selling your products online. So if you are an entrepreneur and you have decided to make your business successful, then in the path towards success, you must have to face some hurdles that makes you frustrated. So in today's video, I'm going to be discussing about such a small issue which you think that is a small, but sometimes it gets very frustrating for you. Yes, I'm talking about Amazon error 5665 which you can find by listing your products to Amazon. So, what this error is, if you are getting this error, then why you are getting this and how you can solve this error. All the information step by step you will get in this video. So keep on watching. But before getting started, I'm Uzair and I sell my products on Amazon, eBay, Shopify, ClickFunnels and Redbubble. And on this channel, I teach people like you that how you can do the same and build your online business. So, if you are new here, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel as well, so you can watch more videos like this. So without any further delay, let's start the video. Alright, so as you can see here, I'm on my Amazon Seller Central and here I'm getting an error which is called error 5665. So first of all, we need to understand that when we will get this error. So, if you are listing a product and while listing your product, you just enter your brand name and that brand name is not a registered brand in the database of Amazon, then you will get this error. So, first of all, let me just show you that what brand name is and if your brand is registered on Amazon database, then how it will look like on your listing. So, for that, we have to go on Amazon and search for any product like uh, bamboo cutting board and here you can see that we are having multiple listings of this product. So, uh, if we open this listing, so we can see that the brand name of this product is Royal Craft Wood, which you can see below the title. That it is saying that visit the Royal Craft Wood store. So that means this is their brand name and this product is listed under that brand name. So that means they are having their brand registered with Amazon brand registry. So when I click on visit the Royal Craft Wood store, so I can see the brand page of that brand Royal Craft Wood store. So that is a brand name that will show under the title of your listing. But what if you are not having your brand registered with Amazon, but still you want your brand name to be shown under the title of your listing. So for that, while listing your product, you have to put your brand name in the brand name section. Let me show you how. Let's just go to Amazon Seller Central and click on catalog and click on add product and then click on I am adding a product not sold on Amazon. So when I click on that, Amazon is asking me for the category of my product. Let's suppose this category is something like fabric. So we can select the category. And then this form opens in front of me. So I have to fill this form to list my product. So you can see that on the vital info tab and on the offer tab, it is giving me two errors like it is asking me to fill out the form. So to remove these marks, we have to fill out that form. So on offer, we can enter the price. And from there, we can select the condition as new. And from there, we can select fulfillment by Amazon. So you can see that all these red marks has been vanished. So now we have to go on vital info. We can just type the name like uh, art fabric towel. And here we have to give the product ID, UPC code and select UPC. And here we have to uh, write the manufacturer part name like SB122. And here, this is the brand name section and this is the manufacturer section. So if you want your brand name to be visible under the title of your listing, so you have to put your brand name here. But if you are not having your brand registered with Amazon, then you will get that 5665 error. Let me just show you how. Like uh, ways to sell online. If I put the brand name and manufacturer name by that, so you can see that Amazon has given me that error, 5665. So that means I must have to register my brand at that name with Amazon in order to put my brand name on that field. But if you're not having your brand registered, still you can do that. Let me show you how. So first of all, you need to read that error message that Amazon must approve your brand before you can use it to list product. Then it is saying when contacting seller support, provide the following information. So that means if you want to remove that error, you have to first of all, take the pictures of your product. Like you must have the logo and the brand name on the packaging of your product. Then you can click some photos of your product from different angles. And then you can just open a case with Amazon seller support and you can just show them your product images with the branding on that. So that means when they verify that this brand belongs to you, then they will allow you to list your product under that brand name. 
like they are telling here. Images of the product and packaging showing the branding on either. The images can show the product and packaging held in hand. So then if we click on branding policy, so we can head to this page and we can see that they are giving us information about these two errors. So in our case, the error is 5665. So they have clearly stated that to remove that error, we need to show them the images of our product containing our brand name and brand logo on that. So then Amazon will allow us to list our product under our brand name. So for that, we have to open a case. And before opening the case, you must be having two to three photos of your product from different angles. So if you are having your product or your supplier is having your product, so you can ask them to click some images from their phone and then send them back to you. So then you can just show these images to Amazon seller support so they can solve your case. And to open that case, you have to first go to the top of your seller center. And from there, you have to click on the help on top right corner. And then you have to go down. You have to click on get support. And then you have to click on selling on Amazon. And then you have to describe the issue. Like I am getting error 5665 while listing my product under my brand name XYZ. Whatever your brand name is. Please allow me to list my product. Below are images attached of my product with branding. Thanks. So then you have to click on continue. Then you have to click on my issue is not in the list. Then you have to click on my issue is related to product listing. And then you have to click on continue. And then you have to click on I don't have an identifier and then click continue. And here you have to select the language English. The contact reason is error 5665. And then here you have to check on this issue is urgent and requires immediate action. And then you have to click on email. And that is the place where you can attach your images. So you have to simply click on add attachment. You have to upload your images and then you have to click on send then your case will be submitted and within 24 hours, someone from Amazon seller support will contact you. If your images are real and they think that your product owns that brand, then they will allow you to list your product under that brand name. So that's easy how it is. So I hope after watching this video, you guys understand the reason of that error. And now you know that how you can remove that error. So if you completely understand this, then make sure to like the video and subscribe the channel as well. So you can watch more videos like this. And if you want me or my team to give you consultancy in your Amazon FBA business regarding any issue from product research to product launch, then you can just reach out to us anytime by just filling a simple form. You can find the link of that form in the description below. So make sure to check out that form if you want to reach out to us. So that's it for today. Let's meet in the next video. Till then, take care. Bye.